This tutorial is going to be about the Action Editor in Gaia, the free looper for Linux, Mac, and Windows. First launch Gaia. Let's load a sample, a drum kick, and switch its play mode to one-shot basic, or any other one-shot play mode. Then let's turn up the volume all of the way. Let's start using the Action Editor. Left click on the sample and select Edit Action. Let's start with the three menu items at the top. The rightmost one will control whether the things we draw in the Action Editor will snap to the grid. If the box is gray, it will snap to grid. The center will control how divided the grid is. The leftmost menu will change how the samples play. Key press will trigger the sample. Kill channel will make the sample stop playing. Key release will act like the key was released. Let's left click after four lines to make the sample play on the beat. Now let's start the beat by hitting space. As you can see the kick will play on the beat. Next let's add a closed tie hat sample. And do the normal, turn up the volume and switch the play mode to one shot basic. Now let's open the action editor and change the grid to 4 and draw the pattern that will give the music a fill when there is no drum kick. Copy what I do, left click to draw blocks and right click to remove them. This might be hard to get at first. This simple pattern will give the loop a cymbal sound. Let's start the beat again by hitting the play head up top. Let's delete these actions by clicking on the sample, then clear actions, all. Next let's trigger the samples by keystroke, right click on each sample and select set key to trigger with a key press. Press enter or this record button to record and let's play a loop. Press enter when you are done, and let's finish play it. That is a very simple way to use the action editor in Gaeta. Read up on the docs on www.giatamusic.com slash documentation to gain more information on this topic. Thank you.